Hello everyone, happy to see you here and in this video we are going to do a very simple math problem and you are going to be surprised that many of you are actually going to get this wrong. So I don't want you to use your calculator right here because as you can see very simple problem 12 plus 6 times 2 and we have a lot of options right here. So what is the correct answer? Of course most of you out there are like yes I can handle this problem, I can handle this, this is basic addition, basic multiplication, I learned this stuff in the third grade, so that's fantastic. So go ahead and put your answer down into a comment section, we have three options, option A, option B, option C, and let's check our answer here in just one minute, it will be really interesting, I swear, so pause the video and try to solve it by yourself. Ok, I hope you, you solve it correctly, but before solving, the, before solving by myself, I want to write this solution. We have 12 plus 6 and times 2. I want to show this approach. I don't want to tell that this is correct or incorrect, but maybe part of students solve it like that, ok? So we have 12 plus 6 times 2. A lot of students go from left to right, we have 12 plus 6, which is equal to 18, and we still have this multiplication, so 18 times 2 equal to equal to 36. And they say ok, we have this option right here, this is option A, and this is a correct answer. But then, then I ask them, ok, what about order of operation, because it's not like a correct order of operation, and for this answer I have this PMDMC order of operation. Doesn't matter what order of operation you prefer, maybe BODMAS, maybe PMDMC, I prefer for example PMDMC, and moreover doesn't matter PMDMC and BODMAS, in this case both are doing great. Yeah. So we have PMDMC order of operation. And let's look, let's solve this, this question according to a correct order of operation and let's check our answer in the end. So 12 plus 6 and times 2. Ok, according to PMDMC we have a lot of steps. First step, parentheses. Are there any parentheses right here? No, I don't see any of those, which is really great. Next step, exponents. Are there any exponents right here? Squares, cube, fourth power, fifth power? No, I don't see any of those, which is really great. Next step, multiplication and division part. Yeah, this is the same group right here, so multiplication and division part. Let's scan, are there any multiplication or division signs right here? Let's look at it. So we have addition, this is not good. Yeah, we have multiplication in the end, so we need to start from this multiplication. And moreover, multiplication is before addition right here. So as you can see, we need to multiply or divide it first, then add and subtract. Yeah. So if we multiply this 6 times 2, we know that this is equal to like 12, yeah? 12 and 12 plus 12 in the beginning, so we have like 24. And then a lot of students ask, okay, what about an option right here? We have 24, but we don't have this option right here. We have 4 factorial, this is not uh, on the first side the same, we have 32, 36, and then part of students go back to this 36, which is absolutely wrong, because according to a correct order of operation, we need to we need to prefer this 24, which is absolutely a correct answer according to PMDAC. So I just wanted to cancel this solution, this is a very bad solution, just forget this solution, this is very bad, so 36, absolutely wrong solution. Correct answer is 24. This is not C, this is not option A, what about this 4 factorial, because we need to choose one option. So 4 factorial, let's look at this 4 factorial real quick. From school we need to know that factorial this is a product from 1 until this number, for example like 6 factorial, 1 to 6. 4 factorial we have like 1 times 2 times 3 and times 4. Let's look at it real quick. 1 times 2, 2, 2 times 3, 6, and 6 times 4, yeah, this is really great. This is 20, 24, which is absolutely the same as 4 factorial, and in the same way, this is the same as our answer, because we, we solve it according to PMDMC, so we have this same answer, 24 right here and 24 right here. So we can easily say that our answer is option, <coughs> the, our answer according to this question this is 24, but according to this test our answer is option, option B. So I write right here our answer and I hope you understand this explanation, really like relaxing algebra problem, I hope you enjoy it. And to, on, the other, on the other hand, if you made this error, I hope you made this, because you won't make this again, and moreover I hope your answer is the same as mine, which is really great, and you remember like a lot of knowledge from school, which is really great. Ok, definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong, if you need to learn basic math, interesting brain test, IQ question, you can easily subscribe to my channel, I really appreciate it. I definitely wish you all the best in your mathematic adventure, thank you for your time and have a great day!